JD and I am here with Joystorm. Knight uses AI to directly sell to customers. Others will just do it soon. A common goal among companies in today's data-driven world is to become smarter, to know where the market opportunities lie, where supply chain log jams are, and where process improvements can be found. Data science has been the fuel behind this trend and now data science is itself becoming smarter thanks to astonishing achievements in artificial intelligence and its sub-segments machine learning and deep learning. It is no surprise that in the last few years the e-commerce sector has seen remarkable growth. Many brands and companies like the billion dollar sportswear behemoth Nike have taken different steps to make this digital transition as effective as possible. Today's story is about Nike. Before I continue, as usual, I would request you to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell icon to keep in touch and keep a tab on my future episodes. Please also like or dislike and put in your valuable comments. Do share my content if you like it. Bill Bowerman was born in Portland, Oregon on February 19, 1911. He became track and field coach at his alma mater, the University of Oregon in 1948. Phil Knight was born in Portland, Oregon on February 24, 1938. Between 1955 and 1959, Phil ran track under Bowerman and graduated in journalism from University of Oregon. After a year in Army, Phil Knight went to grad school at Stanford and got a master's in business administration in 1962. After Stanford, he struck an agreement to distribute the Tiger branded running shoes of Onitsuka company, later ASICS in the US, and introduced them to former coach Bowman. Knight and Bowman found Blue Ribbon Sports on January 25th to sell Onitsuka's Tiger Shoes in the US. The company was founded with US dollar 1200 in the bank. In his quest for lighter, more durable racing shoes for his Oregon runners, Bowerman developed the TG24 running shoe with Onitsuka in 1968. TG24 was later renamed Cortez. Blue Ribbon registered the Nike brand in May 38, 1971, taking the name from the Greek goddess of victory. Student Caroline Davidson designed the brand's logo, the Sush, and got paid US dollar 35 for her work. In 1973, the brand signed U.S. running star Steve Prefontaine, who tragically died in a car wreck two years later. Around this time, the company started dominating track and field in the U.S. Today, Nike Incorporated is an American multinational corporation that is engaged in the design, development, manufacturing, and worldwide marketing and sales of footwear, apparel, equipment, accessories, and services. The company is headquartered near Beaverton, Oregon in the Portland metropolitan area. It is the world's largest supplier of athletic shoes and apparel and a major manufacturer of sports equipment with revenue more than US dollar 30 7.4 billion in its fiscal year 2020. As of 2020, it employed 76,700 people worldwide. 
in 2020 the brand alone was valued more than us dollar 32 billion making it the most valuable brand among sports businesses nike sponsors many high profile athletes and sports teams around the world with the universally recognized trademarks of just do it and swoosh logo some of the most expensive nike shoe endorsement are michael jordan us dollar 60 million a year rory mcleroy us dollars 25 million a year tiger roots us dollars 20 million a year rafael nadal us dollars 10 million a year roger federer us dollars 10 million a year maria sarapova us dollars 8.75 million a year and kobe bryant us dollars 8 million a year nike lab for more than 30 years delivers proven scientific insight which helps drive performance innovations across the Nike brand. The lab team consists of more than 40 researchers in different scientific disciplines such as biomechanics, physiology, physics, maths, biomedical engineering and mechanical engineering. The mission of Nike Incorporated is to drive product innovation for athletes everywhere. Countless ideas are tested in pursuit of aiding performance, injury risk reduction, enhancing perception and feel, and delivery of innovative products to athletes. Some of the incredible innovations out of Nike stable in line with its mission are Nike markets its products under its own brand as well as Nike Golf, Nike Pro, Nike Plus, Air Jordan, Nike Blazers, Air Force One, Nike Dunk, Air Max, Foam Posai, Nike Skateboarding, Nike Sear 7 and subsidiaries including Jordan brand and Converse. Nike also owned Bauer Hockey from 1995 to 2008 and previously owned Cole Haan, Ambro and Hurley International. In addition to manufacturing sportswear and equipment, the company operates retail stores under the Nike Town name. Nike Formidable Enterprise Analytics framework serves as the bedrock of its data analytics revolution. First and foremost, their analytics system are fully integrated so they can easily connect predictive variables ranging from social media behavior to purchase patterns to better understand an anticipated customer behavior. Secondly, Nike has also successfully deployed self-service capabilities so that Every member of its senior leadership team has access to fully customized analytics dashboard that is tailored to their decision making needs. Furthermore, as Nike considers itself a creative company, they have invested heavily in data visualization tools to ensure insights are as easily digestible as possible. That is all for today. Thank you and goodbye for now.